another video for you guys. You already know it's a Shop Missé haul. I love Shop Missé. It's all about that Barbie on a budget. It's an online $1 beauty supply store. They also have other trinkets that cost a little bit more. I think it's more on their skincare and like um, like bath bombs and stuff like that but for the most part you can get a large majority of the products for one dollar you can get makeup brush kits for basically a dollar a brush like you don't get no better than that so if you want to learn more about this shop Masse website I'll have everything linked down below if you like these types of videos don't forget to like comment and subscribe turn on your notification bell because that's when you're notified when I post new videos because YouTube is doing its own little thing nowadays so just make sure you hit that bell if you want to see more of me but Stay tuned. Um, but yes, let's get sporty. Um, the first things that I got, you guys know, I always get my, I always get my my face mask because I don't play that. I'm all about skincare. You cannot slay and beat your face with bumps and lumps. I mean, you can. Don't get me wrong, because I'm not gonna sit here and act like I have the clearest skin on the planet. But I have definitely cleared it up, and I like to treat my skin. I like to take care of my skin. Skincare is the number one thing when it comes to beauty and glam. Like, you need to take care of that skin up underneath that makeup, okay? So, the first thing that I got, I got a set of, like, um, face masks. Um, these are, I mentioned this in the previous um, Shop Masse hauls that I've done in the past, that a lot of these products are made in Korea. Korean skincare is Japanese, Korean, and maybe even Chinese. I'm not too sure about Chinese skincare, but Japanese and Korean skincare is A1. They are beyond the times when it comes to um, American skincare. They're all about the molecular function on how to make your skin act right, look right, and behave the way it's supposed to, okay? So the first mask that I got is a tr uh, tea tree calm and refresh. So this one helps to refresh tired skin, reduces the signs of strain and fatigue, tones and energizes while providing tightening effects, for plump and supple complexion like who doesn't want to look supple and plump like come on and like most sheep baths you apply them for about 15 to 10, 20 minutes at a time and I will do like a sheet mask on like a spa day um, and if you guys want me to film a video on what I do on my spa days definitely comment down below your girl loves skincare so I, I go in when it comes to spa day but yeah I will put these on on spa days so that's a tea tree. The next one I got was aloe vera hyaluronic acid. I'm gonna put on the screen all the benefits of hyaluronic acid because a lot of this is actually written in um, Korean. Anyways, hyaluronic acid basically is great at plumping up the skin, moisturizing the skin from within. Got is I got a shop from the AOA line quite often. I love that line. It's an affordable brush, um, makeup, cosmetic tool line from shop miss a it's like their own brand that they produce so this is a um brush cleaner so this is good for when you're doing um eye looks and you want to just kind of clean off your brush in between you see that like how i did this look today like i use a couple brushes but if i would have had that i saved this i didn't open this until this video but um i would have probably used this to kind of clean my brushes off I wouldn't use like your big face brushes on this but I would definitely use like eyeshadow brushes and stuff and then you could just easily cleanse this because you want to make sure this is cleansed easily cleanse this with soap and water the next thing that I got is a E144 brush it is my ride or die eyebrow brush if you want an updated eyebrow tutorial um, I will film it I actually my eyebrows microbladed but yes the girl took the plunge got her eyebrows microbladed I'll have a whole video on that I just did my follow-up appointment where I touch up so it's really dark right now so I have to wait till it fades a little bit I literally this is my third one and I have all I have the other two this is just me adding to the collection because sometimes I don't feel like washing my brushes every damn day so it's nice to just have an additional brush because I always do my brow and they got a whole entire I'll put on a screen okay they have entire brush sets for like 10 12 bucks like it don't get no better than that man it really don't um I have this baked eyeshadow I thought this was a highlight honestly I thought this was a highlight but I got this baked eyeshadow Ooh. I'm gonna swatch it just to see. I don't like swatching products, 
for hygienic reasons but I'll swatch it just to sh show you guys I would honestly use this as like a highlight but so on to the fun stuff like the last couple stuff that I got is gonna be real fun real cute and what they eat <laughs> But yeah, the main reason why I wanted to get this, I think this was like $10. I think the max this was is like 11 bucks, okay? You get a nice brush holder. Um, you get this cute little, because at the end of the day, I'm going to still use this, especially I have a couple of trips coming up. I'm going to BeautyCon LA. Comment down below if you're going to BeautyCon LA. I would love to see you guys out there. I'm just going there. Um because I've never been to LA and I've never been to Bucon and I'm just like, why not do both? Like, why not? You know? <laughs> but yeah, I'm like so excited. Anyways, so you get these beautiful, beautiful brushes. Look at that. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten brushes. Ten brushes, okay? Ooh, this one's a dual brush. It actually has a spoolie at the end. Spoolie and an angle brush. I probably wouldn't use this angle brush. It looks really floppy and flimsy. <laughs> but this is an eyeshadow brush set. They all have little numbers. I promised a video on a shop miss a I like brush tutorial the face brushes that I had gotten from the shop miss a line I don't use that many of them because they're just too complex for me I'm just too like even though you see me glammed here like I'm real simple when I do my makeup I literally use maybe eight brushes tops and the only reason why it's eight is when I do eyeshadow looks obviously I'll use like a more fluffy brush and then I'll use a more like um like a crease brush and then I'll use like a flat brush so that's three brushes on the eye area so yeah um, but this is a lot easier for me to utilize and to do a tutorial with because these are just eyeshadow brushes like this one would be perfect for blending out your product it's like a fluffy brush and then they got a couple of them here's another real nice fluffy one this is angled. This one would be nice for the crease. This is a nice lippy brush. If not a lippy brush, maybe a corner, like depositing a little bit of highlight in the corner of your eye. More um, fluffy brushes. Uh, this one. I never know what type of brush this is. I'm not that good with brushes, man. These are my favorite. I, when I learned how to do makeup, the person who taught me, she said, because I have big eyes, I need to have nice flat brushes because it helps to deposit the product better because I have a lot of eye space. You see that? <laughs> but I do. So flat brushes are my friend. And the more flat brushes I have, the happier the, your girl is, okay? And then this one's nice and fluffy too. This one's kind of weird shaped. I don't know. And they're super soft. Oh my god. Yeah, please, please, please comment down below if you want a, a tutorial because your girl will definitely do a tutorial with these. I don't know if I use all of them in one tutorial because this is doing the most and I don't use that much product like colors on my lids. But I'll try my very best. And then I have a dual um, brush. I think I showed you guys this one already. Spooly, you know, you've got to make sure you blend out that um, eyebrow product. I don't know if all my makeup brushes could fit in here, like my big brush, my face brushes and stuff, but I'll sure enough try. I will definitely try. I spent uh, $11 on it. I'm going to make the best out of my $11. Shoot. Okay, the next set of stuff that I got, I think I'm going to start off with, hmm, this vibrant, like, it's almost like a crimson reddish. Oh, it's so vibrant. It kind of reminds me of that Universal um, Lippy from Fenty Beauty. Kind of reminds me of that. So I got my little mirror from Shop Miss A from my previous haul. How cute is that? So this is what I'm going to use to apply the, the um, lippies. So I just took off my previous slip color with a little bit of coconut oil from Shea Moisture and just a paper towel. So that's what I'm going to use to switch in between. So I'm going to start off with that crazy crimson. Your girl cannot do a lip without 
her True Brown K by Kylie. This is not from Shop Missé. This is Kylie Cosmetics. Liner. I just can't. I'm scared. I'm real scared, but we'll give it a shot. Ooh, it kind of smells good. I'm gonna just keep going in. I feel like it doesn't, not very opaque. You gotta really layer this stuff up. It's almost like it's a gloss. No, it says it's a matte. This is that Nicki Minaj pink bang. I cannot ask for everything, it's a dollar. <laughs> you know, it's a damn dollar. Okay. This is doing the most, doing the absolute most. I'm not sure how it's coming off on camera, but in real life it looks a mess. Maybe I just don't know what I'm doing. And that's Savage. The name of this one is called Savage. <laughs> She's Savage though. <laughs> oh. Oh shoot. Got it all over my damn. I'm taking this mess off. <laughs> okay, so now we are gonna do Echo. Ooh. This one is pretty damn opaque. Find my lip. This is a fun color. This is my first time really dibbling and dabbling with um, color like this. Like I will do an orange, but like I'll tone it down. This is a good way to try like bright, crazy colors. Hmm. This one dries down pretty matte, pretty quick too. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know if it's because of the purple still on there. This smells like white out. So I know you guys seen those lip colors. They looked a mess. We can't ask for everything for a dollar, right? But they got the makeup brushes on point. Okay, on point. Um, sheet mask is on point as well. Definitely, if you guys would like to see me do a spa day, comment down below. I'll be sure to film that for you guys. And um, yeah, this is like perfect for traveling. Look how pure, look how cute this is. Look at this look. This is just everything. And you could use either side. Let's say you have more brushes. You can have some brushes in this one. And some brushes in the other like this is so perfect for traveling it don't get no better than that and for like $11 come on it don't get no better than that I just want to thank you guys so much for watching this video definitely comment down below and just let me know what you think um, so yeah stay tuned for more of my vlog playlist I have a whole playlist on like fitness routines what I eat um, my behind the scenes this is my most recent vlog and I also have a giveaway on a Juvia's Place palette so definitely check that out I love you guys so much bye